morning we're at a new area haven't been here before bit short of outcast today let me show you we've got the rust the one and only rust master just the one today just the one and we've got aaron unfortunately the squeak is, uh, yes stayed in the uh, um, the peak is a down with the man nick's looking after was in skegness so it's just us three but these two have had a couple of throws and they've done amazing already oh so um, <laughs> yeah that's good but anyway i'm going to get on because i'm going to turn the camera around because i don't want to show steve's fine let's see how we get on here Yeah, you're right there's some history in here look at that for me first paul rusty was going on about history well really it's just his first phone look and i've got a pair of scissors not much left of them but yeah mobile phone and a pair of scissors first paul you got a fence spike <laughs> yeah yeah <laughs> Scav clamp and <laughs> bracket. Aaron's just winding Rusty up. What you got, Aaron? I've got a very, very smelly bushwhacker. I think they'll see the back half of it. <laughs> Yeah, it is. So Aaron's got an old horn. So I've got a coat hanger. I've got part of a D lock. Another scaff clamp and another bike lock. And it's green tape. It is like a, a little shank. Yeah. Aaron's found his first shank of the day. So I've got a scaff camp. And an umbrella. And the remains of a sign. Got a pair of wire cutters. A bit of a bike lot. Another bit of bike lot. And a chav can. Oh, for God's sake. Another bike lock. And I've been finding an amazing amount of these at Bridges. Sat nav. Bloody sat nav. Reminds of a cool spring. Another chav can. So, Mrs. L. Platt. Oh, there you go. Mrs. L. Platt, you've lost your glasses and your card. Don't worry, I've got them. What you got, Aaron? I've got a spoon. What else you got? A fork. What else you got? A knife. <laughs> so that's my, it's Nicholas Spoon, my fork and your knife. <laughs> Full set. My little chisel. You've got... Or a file. Chisel and file. It's all right, because I've got my own fork. You can, got, <laughs> you can fork off now. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh, look at that. <laughs> Come on then, get putting. <laughs> murder weapon. Oh, murder weapon found. Yeah, look, there we go. I've got a putter. What you got, Aaron? Got a little wheel. That's really good. That's a spark plug. <laughs> bit of pipe. And some handlebars. Can I have your own wheel? Yeah. I want to see if I take Rusty's head off. <laughs> <laughs> it works. <laughs> Missed him. Oh, 
Oh, look. <laughs> I've got a D-lock with the keys in it. <laughs> and a bit of random pole. You know the best thing is? Look. So. Still there. Wow. <laughs> so the D lock I just found with the keys in, it still works. Unbelievable! Oh, mind you, look, it's a cheap import one. Uh. <laughs> padlock, padlock. <laughs> <laughs> I'll keep that though. You never know. Better headphones. I've got a weed pipe. Do you want that, Steve? No. For them lonely nights? No, you're all right. You give it up now. There's nothing for me. Right, so if you're a manufacturer of bike locks, yeah, they don't work. You've really got to start improving them because all we find is loads of them. Absolutely useless, your bike locks are. I think it says Alfred's on it. That sort of explains it then, really, doesn't it? <laughs> you have to say it quietly. What time is it, Aaron? Nickel hammer time. Maybe it's Nicholas. It's a sledgehammer for Nicholas. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that. Oh, Got a can. Scaff pole. There we go. It's got a key. And another umbrella. What have you found, Aaron? No, oh, another, another bike. That's two now. Two bikes. That's the smallest knife I've ever seen. And a bigger knife. <laughs> and a big blade. <laughs> I've got a can of pistachios. Gone from guns to knives. <laughs> <laughs> He's found a pair of knives. <sighs> I don't think somebody played very good golf round here. That's the second putter. Bit of crushed steel. Another weed pipe. Right, so Aaron's got a really, really old car light now. Print it in a bit. Paraffin one then, will it for the wick on the side? Possibly. Paraffin or what's that gas they used to use? They used to use, uh, add a bit of water or something to create a gas, didn't they? Oh, okay. I don't know, ain't that old? Tell us. I can't remember the name of it. <laughs> but there you go, turn it sideways, Aaron. Look at that, that is proper old lamp, that is. It's definitely a keeper, that one. Yeah, I think it's going to fall to bits, but yeah. we'll see what it... If you're right with a bit of a steam clean, see what it's like. Yeah. Not even an hour and a half, we've been here about They're three peg. quarters of an hour. Cost a card. Absolutely incredible. And a ring. It really is. Huh? Yeah, true. <laughs> Can what? Right, so seems to be collecting scaffold clamps. And a D lock. Yeah. There we go. Another, Collection of bike locks. The Again. About so I've got a can opener. I've got the remains of a compass. And I've got a dynamo off a bike. So I've got a padlock and a key and a lipstick and some keys and some mints. Oh, two padlocks. He's got more padlocks. He's got some keys. I'm coming down. He can speak for himself. I've got a D lock key. I've got an old key. And I've got a fence pin, a razor blade, and if I can grip it properly. And a shell. It's different. Another scaff pole and a bungee strap. Put the handle. 
spoon. And two ox. And a screwdriver. Bait box. Yeah. Right, so Amra's got a bait box for mice or rats and some lump of metal. What you got then, Amra? A load of poles and a bite lock. Oh, well, there's a surprise. A thermostat. I'm close to it. So I've got some cafe creme. Right, okay, so the things you do find in magnet fish are very unusual. Aaron's found a pine glass, right? <laughs> <laughs> Unbelievable. Look how it's stuck, it's because there's a coin on the inside. That's held on there with a coin. Unbelievable. <laughs> so, got a big old bolt. And a dinner knife. Yeah. Aaron's found an old foot peg off a motorbike. Some kind of old transformer, isn't it? And an old transformer. <laughs> what is it with you and knives today? I don't know, but I'm not counting, so you have to let me know when you do the editing. <laughs> I just found a dinner knife. I've got a lock key. Hey? <laughs> right, so boats can't get along here because the bridges are too low. But I found a lock key and an old sign, but it's too far gone. A bit of gutter in and another fence pot oh, spike. Yeah, <laughs> spike. <laughs> Aaron's got another bait box. Are you looking for? So, what? Sorry. <laughs> oh, I've got a I'm now boot shoe. <laughs> there you go. I've got a tiny little boot shoe. Children's one, that one. Tiny. He's got a brolly. So have I. Oof. And a pedal. I've got a wheel. <laughs> Aaron's got a pyramid just to find something colder. <laughs> but yeah, I think I think there's an hole in me bucket. So I've got an old bike saddle with suspension and something which is like a lever bar. Quite sure what that is. What do you reckon? <laughs> there you go, Murray. Put the kettle on. <laughs> there we go, I've got a really old can. It's got the pierced top. It's too far gone to see what it is, though. Go on, Aaron. Stall for Nicola. <laughs> I'm one of them. That's like a bar stall, then? Yeah. It's a high one? Yeah. Or is it a high chair? He's got a boot shoe as well now. That's a funny shaped boot. Little, isn't it? <laughs> Two more padlocks. Two more padlocks. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I've done all that. So I've got an old bowl and another fence pole. I've got World War II helmet, Steve. What? World War II helmet. Aaron's got an umbrella, a scaff clamp, a um, oh, paint scraper, and a what? Zippo, eh? <laughs> so you know Aaron got his pint glass. I've got one now, look. And not only that, Sunny Kelsey is. Yeah. And look at that. <laughs> That's a really old camera, that is. So, you've got an old camera as well. <laughs> got the old gear change, three speed bike. 
What you got then, Aaron? A fork and knife. Another one? Yeah. <laughs> I've got a spoon now. Now I've got a spoon. <laughs> So as far as I know, we are nowhere near a train track. Absolutely nowhere. And what's Aaron going to pull up? A flipping track detonator. Aaron, we're nowhere near a flipping train line. <laughs> no. <laughs> and a padlock. Is that a padlock on there? Now I've gone and got a push bike as well. So it's two to Aaron, one to me. Uh, guess what I've got? Tell us, Aaron, what got you got? Another knife. <laughs> another yeah, another padlock. <laughs> another padlock. <laughs> Scrap man's gonna do all right. Oh, you swine! Well, I'm definitely getting an handlebar on it, and <laughs> you're getting a shoe. Here we go, handlebars and a shoe. A mag. So I've got a bit of my bike chain. Aaron got a cannibal. Well, we told Glenn it was. It's a bike bell, really. And I've got an old padlock. So, yep, old padlock. So I've got that. It's got like a gear on the end. I'm sure what it is, though. And the back end of a push bike. Set of keys. Ah, oh, you're swine. And I've got the remains of a wheelbarrow. That's an old army torch. There we go, and I just found an old army torch. Look, old army flashlight. That's cool. Absolutely brilliant, that. Ugh. That's a meat hook, isn't it? I'm sure that's a meat hook. I think that's a meat hook. I'll stand corrected if it's not, but he's got a hook. There we go, got a load of old chain. Remains of an old purse. Where you going now? Scales, scanner, TV screen. Oh, oh he's got inputs. Could be one of them visual entry systems. So, Aaron's got one of these. Looks like one of those visual entry screens. Got it dripping everywhere, stinks like hell. Right, what you found, Aaron? A knife in a sheath. So the lever's broke. I think you're going to have to let that dry. Oh, mind you, the stitching's going to go, isn't it? Oh, look at that. That's very nice. I'm not sure what number knife it is of the day, but <laughs> I'm sure we'll find out soon. <laughs> it's another knife. Hang <laughs> on, to zoom in on it. What you found, Aaron? Another push bike. Another one, number four. You show me up now, it's three to one. Yeah. How many knives you had? I had a sword, mate. It overrides any of them. 
All right, what you got, Aaron? An old piece of cast iron pot with a number 10 on it. I can see that. He's got a number 10 pot. Brilliant. Hang on. What you got, Aaron? Two brollies. A pair of brollies. They're getting bigger. Yeah. They're dueling brollies. Sorry, mate. You've got some bits if you didn't get that. Got no bagger. Oh, flipping out. Three keys. Hang on. What you got, Aaron? Three keys. And a bigger hob now. Or a small donkey. Yeah, I'll add my bag up. There you go. Another bike lock. Old can opener and a rod rest. <laughs> and Aaron's got somebody's magnet. Do your eye bolts up with some thread lock. Yeah. Got a gate hinge. An old bolt with loads of wire wrapped around it. Nicola, I found your front door key. There we go. <laughs> Nicola, I found your other front door key. I've got your spare. One for was. And now I've got two more. You've got some for the kids as well. So it's all four front door keys, Nicola. So it remains of a rod rest and some more fence poles. Yeah. Another scaff clamp, it's cast on gutter. And another key. A little bit of a fence topper. Well, that's when he was born. <laughs> <laughs> what you got, Aaron? Well, I've got some kind of revolver. It's hard to see in there. Bring it in a bit closer. We need to let there it we go. Look, you can see the handle. You can see the trigger, boy's thumb. But no barrel on it, but there we go. Let it dry off a bit. Still a cool find, though. A little bit there on the barrel, maybe. But there we go. <sighs> Is that your earring or your necklace? Probably. <laughs> What you got, a Mr. T starter kit? Yeah. <laughs> You've got some jewellery. So I've just had a bag up with a load of money in. It's a load of euros. So you can just see it on that one. But yeah, all euros. And a bit of the old cast on fencing. There we go. Bit of an old light. And a pair of nail clippers. Bolt off a garden gate and a stand off something. Oh, bells. Oh, God. Christ almighty. So, got an old saucepan lid. Look at that for an old Nokia phone. <laughs> Back in the day, that was proper old school. What's that? Oh, it's decorative. That's a fireplace. Yeah, it's a fireplace. Yeah. It's a beat one and all. These are worth money though. They are as well, the decorative. You can sell them because people keep them just as uh, display pieces. It's a shame it ain't got this one. Yeah. But that on its own and that on its own are sellable. If well, it might be in there, yeah. If you can get them apart. Right, so there we go. I've got a piece of an old fireplace all cast iron. So you see it's all decorative down the side. Nice find that. Oh, look. Wow! That's a good nick, isn't it? That 
is really good. Look at the size of that thing. Throw it back in. <laughs> <laughs> I could use this one on you. Oh, can opener. <laughs> Think you'd sort his rusty nuts out with your can opener. Got a scaff tube joiner. Nah, not quite sure what that is though. I think it's a bell. I'm gonna try and get some of the crud off it. Looks like it. Are they? Yeah, cleaned up, you get 30 quid for that. Really? Yeah, they're very collectible. Well, I suppose if you're people renovating an antique house as well. Well, no, people use them as planters on the front of their house. They put loads of them up. Put plants in them, mind you. Still got the eye holes. Yeah, it's still got the eye holes, yeah. No, careful, it's cast. Yeah, I know, that's why I'm only tapping it, not smacking it. They look lovely painted up and planted. <sighs> So I've got a padlock, little one. <laughs> and I've got a gutter in bit for the downpipe. Now Rusty said that's worth about 30 quid cleaned up. Probably cost me 20 to do it, but if I give it Glen, it won't cost me a penny. Cheers, Glen. Bit of bar and about. Small power plies. So Aaron's got himself an umbrella. University of Cambridge. He's come home. Yeah, nice. So Aaron's got the tiniest you've ever seen. Nicola, yes, he's still sharp to you. <laughs> Bit more great. And half a purse. Yeah. What you got, Aaron? I've got a smelly handbag. <laughs> what you got? Just some perfume. And we need it. Oh, some tablets. You got, you got the pill? <laughs> yeah. At least you ain't gonna get pregnant. Oh, you got an airbrush as well. Oh, oh you got compact, a lipstick. Is it, is it Oude Canal? Oh mate. Oh they got a little brush to go with it. <laughs> Come back to the crayfish back that's sitting there and getting some down. And a brush. It's got a bit of content. Just smell the handbag. Oh. Yeah, it's crayfish just sitting down there. Look at that for a nail, only Aaron can find a nail that big. Look at the size of that thing. That's for one big vampire. Yeah, some sort of metal box. Of course, nothing in it, but that's all right. He's got Aaron. Two more knives. He's got a couple more knives. And more a load of, knives. and some more iron. <laughs> some prop friends of history here. Bit of rebar. Part of the old fence. And another padlock. A bit of flat plate, a bit of angle on, and a bit of chain. Another bit of flat plate. Audio cassette for Nicola. <laughs> <laughs> so I've got another scaffold clamp. What you found, Aaron? I found an audio cassette for Nicola. <laughs> <laughs> Everything's small, and I found. An exhaust pipe, but the end broke off when it fell off the magnet. So more guttering, just push bar. Got old tape measure as well. We'll say it's the back end of a motorbike, probably would have the number plate on it. And you see where the light went when my fingers were coming through? Old motorbike part. 
different. Mm. He's got another knife. Aaron, what is it with you and Blades today? I'm blaming the elf. It's a pruning no. knife. Pruner. Show him, Aaron, why are you finding so many knives today? Hang on, one second. He's going to show you why he's finding so many knives. Look who's back. He lives. Aaron won him last week in the auction at the charity club and he's back. He put the rope through the top of yeah. it. <laughs> They're gonna lose it then, aren't they? <laughs> so I've got the end of a shotgun shell, 410. Little thing. Just the metal bit though. Here we go, another old bite lock. One. There we go, got a Vaseline. So everybody, you know we announced Friday we're giving away a car. This is the man here that's been generous, look. He doesn't like camera, look, but there we go. That man there who's running off, who's hiding, he's the one that's done it, so you can thank him for it. Cheers, Dean. <laughs> well, I couldn't let him beat me, so I've found a gun as well. So, yes, it's a toy one, but a gun is a gun. Look at that, that's two now. And you need to go and watch Rusty Nuts video because he's had an amazing find as well. There we go, it's got an old key. And that old light. I think it's what they should call a bullet light. Look at that, it's proper old school. Makes a change, Rusty. What you got, Aaron? Uh, I got another knife. Another one. <laughs> it's quite a nice one, that one. Oh, cool. Good luck. Have a nice day. Thanks for your... Well, there we go, Nicola. I found your skateboard. Your front wheels are damaged, but I've got a little skateboard with a picture on the bottom. Hang on, I'll show you that. It's like an onion. And got like a ash box cover. I would have slid up back in the day. Right, so I've had my oldest find today. And now I've found a cannon. Hang on. Put it in secrecy. Not lying. I've found a cannon. It's a scanner, but still a cannon, isn't it? So I've just pulled up a wallet. We've got a key in it. I've got some ID. For the first time ever, I found a lizard. There we go. So I've got a lizard in there and a load of loose chain. I've got a lizard, Steve. <laughs> so, Aaron has just found some weighing scales. That's good. <laughs> That's proper cars behind that. Hang on, let's try them out. Too fat. Get off me. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah. A proper old set, a cast iron, weighing scales. I'll tell you what, I'm glad I didn't find that. He's got to move it yet. <laughs> but there we go. Amazing find. Could have been deep enough for that to be hidden. <laughs> no. <laughs> How did it get out there? <sighs> I'll stand here. Yeah. Go on then, Aaron. Oh, junior hacksaw. I was gutted with that one. <laughs> that was a bit guttering. You've got a porthole for Nicola. That's out of the tank. Is that the flat where she gets out? <laughs> Sorry, Nick. That's a bugger, that is, isn't it? That's a big foal, that is. And some bite locks in stereo. Hang on. Let me lower it. Look. Oh, no, he's going to lift it. He's got a shopping trolley to go with his shopping trolley. Ah, look at that. Look at that exhaust. That's an old Norton, that is, mate. You reckon? <laughs> Stinks. Oh, you got a briefcase? Yeah, old. I don't think you're going to hold your sandwiches and that. No. Look, guess what? Oh, look, a bite lot. It's unusual to find one of them. Maybe one pie? Little pie dish, little enamel one. No, you're filling up all out. We got a pump. He's got a pump. You know I had the uh, motorbike? Footstand. You've got another one. Scarf clamp. 
Look at them old little AMF oh. radios. It's not personal because that's personal because that you can see the buttons on the side. Oh yeah it is. It's personal stereo. I've been collecting these. <laughs> all different sorts. now boot shoes and all shoes and shoes. Uh, and a bit. It's something. Yeah, yeah, something yeah. Lift this up a bit, you're too tall. There we go. Oh speak. It is that? Yeah. Oh siren or something. Probably off that police car that's in there. A bit more guttering and an absolute belter. You're not going to get his own for Christmas. And look, and here's Zoe. Look, all in pink, look. And stuff in the face. <laughs> Got ya. <laughs> going to get Aaron in one of them tops. Not that one though, because he ain't going to get in it. Umbrella. <laughs> He's got a shoe. And this one's quite good. Apparently, I'm the chosen one. <laughs> <laughs> for what? Does it say what you're chosen for? It's a thirst privilege card. <laughs> <laughs> ah, it means you can drink the water. Oh, uh, no. Nice basket. Which he's using to put his stuff it's on the side. Great. It's like the supermarket sweet for you, this, isn't it? You got a <laughs> twirly thing. <laughs> Look, he's good. He's a bit good at that, isn't he? Do you think that's what he used to do as a kid? He used to twirl with twirl with the girls. The dress, the dress says it all. Doesn't it it does. Yeah, he used to wear a dress, and now he can twirl. More <laughs> gas pipe. And just an absolute load of scrap down here that I'm going to clean up. And there we go. Look, let me just show you. This. Ooh, hang on a minute. And down there, as you can see, look. Just loads and loads of rubbish. But now he's on a mission. Oh look, he's got a, he's got a brolly. Mary <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is some of your stuff, Notch. Right, there we go. So that's a alt thing with a bit of wood on it. That's the cast iron plate of something. That's the tank barrel. No, it's not, it's a bit of guttering. Oh, and one. that is a sad iron, but the handle's missing, but we're gonna keep that. He's looking very sad for itself. Oh, we didn't do this yet, did we? Oh, and look what Aaron got as well. No, it's not a can of coke. It's a smoke grenade. <laughs> so I'll put a smoke grenade. A little bit different on the ages there. Scab, Scab lamp. lamp. I thought down here. Yep, there is. Fuel cap. <laughs> He's got a fuel cap, if you can't hear him. There's another load of chab cans. There's another load of car stuff. There's tons there's of it. There's tons of rubbish. Oh, look. There's my shoe there. I've got... A hobnail thing behind you oh yeah i actually got the heel as well as the hobnail boot thing at least we don't got the fork because that's what we don't want <laughs> no there's your bottle opener. oh it's my bottle opener and my knife a little bite light a little bite light a little bit more modern than the one i had earlier <laughs> scaff scaff lamp. Lamps. so yeah as you can see just loads and loads of stuff but it's been a good day so far let's carry on yeah there you go. And you've got an adjustable spanner, but it's too high. There we go, adjustable spanner. Oh, oh, Aaron found a pair of scissors. Yeah, it's, yeah. And a load of security tags. Yeah, it's only scaring them. Oh, I've got an A-frame for a road sign. So I've got a mud flap. And a wheel rim. Oh, yeah, torch. A little torch. Loads more of these fence spikes and some random rubbish. There's a really, really old torch. Which is mouldy. Centre of a bike wheel and a fish slice. Keys in a carabiner. Random metal piece. Scaff joiner. Base of a bucket. An expensive jewellery box. Where's the jewellery, Dean? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Another one of them. Never fancy spots everywhere. 
A massive clock. <laughs> that was Christian. <laughs> oh, he's a massive clock, is he? <laughs> he's got a key. <laughs> I've got a purse. I've got a pole. I don't know what that is. It's a dodgy looking mushroom. I've got half a bench. No, it's not one even. I've got a bit and another bit. Mine's really good. Bottle opener. I've got a couple of gears or something. And I've got a bike lock. That could be the other half of the scale. Counting balance part. We were having that as the other half of my scales. The Dane fan. And he got it out on his own. And a pair of crosses. Yeah, I know. You're on camera. Mama. Not quite. <laughs> it's an old scraper. Huh? That's an old wheel. Dean, what are you doing? <laughs> Is that Christian as well? Is that his clock? <laughs> there we go. We've got the photographic evidence, but I can't show you. <laughs> Bite lock. Scrap. A ring and a bit of a sign. That bit. Can't beat a rusty ring. <laughs> Aaron, have you lost your G-string? <laughs> <laughs> if it is, I'd plug it in if I was you. The wheels. You won't be able to lean it because Nigel's not here, but look, it's another padlock. Yeah. Oh! Oh! oh, 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 oh. I've got a sword. <laughs> I told you we were going to be the three musketeers. Oh, he has an all. Oh! It's a fencing sword. <laughs> that could be really old. That's a sabre. Not a, not a sabre, I forget the name of them now. That could be to the end. Yeah. That is unless, unless that's plastic. No. <laughs> no, because I'd one of them before. <laughs> oh, yeah, he's had four, hasn't he? Hey, you just ruined my video. <laughs> <laughs> is, uh, wow. wow. <laughs> I'm in shock. Oh, I really am. So... Look at that. I know. It was only joking. I got when a he sword. Said the... It was only joking when he said the three musketeers are here. Look at that. Unbelievable. Jump in the model it Yeah, I'm gonna. There we go, so look. That is a sword. Oh my god. That is unbelievable. Absolutely unbelievable. That is proper old. Oh <laughs> I'm well happy with that. Oh, that's the first for me. I found samurais, but I always wanted a sword, and look at that. That is only there. This will be behind us, but we're not gonna say where, because you're not having our location. <laughs> There we go. That is awesome. It's triangular as well, so that's old. I've got a wine glen up. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that is awesome. Is that a blade and all? Oh, I don't know. It's a spearhead. It's the head of a spear. Oh my god, are you ready for this? You, you shut it off again. No, this is much better. I found a sword. Oh god. Oh god. <laughs> that is proper old. <laughs> Look at that. That is proper old. And. Yeah. And on his same magnet. Hang on, hang on, we haven't finished yet, same pull. On his same magnet, a spearhead. <gasps> oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! Oh, the moon is trying to fucking find it. Oh yeah, look at that. 
<laughs> That's the only bad bit. That's the only bad bit there. Look, hang on. Look at that. How old's that? What, Steve? <laughs> what, Steve or the sword? Look, in one pull. <laughs> Oh. And he's only moved down oh 20 God. feet. I've only thrown three times here. <laughs> oh, you've got your bucket this side, mate. Oh, hang on. Oh, hang on. Oh. Aaron's got, he's got a cannonball. Oh, <laughs> 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 right, it's a bell. It's a bike bell. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Awesome. <laughs> oh, sure. I'm sweating. Oh yeah, but that look yeah, at it. Proper fencing sword though. This is this is history. I'm still excited about the sword. And there's another thing. Show it, Rusty. Now Rusty thinks this might be a spearhead. Now I don't know. We're not sure, but we're not sure. But this def both of these definitely need checking out. Look at that. I'm pretty sure that that is a spearhead. And I'm pretty sure that's a fencing sword yeah. with a triangular blade and everything. Some proper history there. Fantastic. It's be one of the oldest finds you've ever had, that. I mean, yeah, it's older than you. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Just. Steve. Just. <laughs> what you got, Aaron? Oh, an old coat can. <laughs> oh, yeah. What else have you got? Uh, another little pen off. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there's a surprise. I can't get over that. That's, in, that's amazing. Absolutely amazing. <sighs> I've got some old bits of road sign. Got the sign and a cone base. Umbrellas. Cast iron gutter in. bike seat and a bit of a motor a bike light and a road lamp gas on it Good bike bell. Pipe union. Another bike lock. Manage a padlock, a spoon, a wiper arm, and a bit off the road sign. Random bars, a couple of scaff clamps. Got a wallet, I've got a knife, and some more, some more bars. Got a metal cap off something, spark plug, and a pair of pliers. Got a handrail, a mudguard, and a bracket. More scaffolding. Found a can of Stella. <laughs> a 
and another sign. <sighs> Unbelievable. So I've just pulled up that. I can believe it's a coin, because you can see on the edge, it is like serrated on the edge, and it's got that copper look to it, but I'm not sure what, but we're gonna keep that and give it a clean up. Another blooming brolly. Third so part of a road sign. Little bird feeder type thing. Actually, it's probably a candle holder. Bit of bar with a pebble on it. A clipper, electronic, which is not a clipper. And Aaron found that. Little coggy tooth thing. It's like a jawbone for a vampire. I thought it was a, <laughs> a lot of metal teeth coming out at the moment, if it is. It's my third one today. Swords and crap pipes. So there we go. Got another weed pipe. And some lippy. End of the month here. Yeah. Oh yes! Oh yes! Oh, I'm clear I was here. No, 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 it's not a bayonet, it's, it's a, a dagger. dagger. It's a dagger. In its case. Oh, what? <laughs> you have done. It's still in his scabbard. Yeah. It's in its sheath, rather. That's amazing. Oh, now that's cool. No. Go and tell me. <laughs> I told you I was going to get something else. And... Right, hang on, hang on, hang on. Wow, did it's you all get... you like here, you got to remember that. Did you, did you get those two things out? Um, did you get those things today? Those yeah, all out of here. Yeah. Yeah. All out of here. How old do you reckon that is? That's got to be... A similar age? Similar age to that, yeah. Wow, that is amazing. Can you imagine who must have had that? Me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Bags is got something eight. in there. Look, that's where it would have had the yeah. holster piece, look. Yeah, on the leather strap. Yeah. That's amazing. I would... It would have been... You're, somebody knows what to do and we'll be able to get it out of the, the sheath. I bet that's brass as well. No, not necessarily. If it's old, it won't be. That's nuts. That is. Oh, man. That's a fine fishing <laughs> man. You could not. You're going to get a suit of armour for ages. The end of the day. I bet you find a suit of armour. <laughs> long as no one's in it. <laughs> well, there you go. That is. You feel awesome. the weight of it. Wow, that is nuts. I'm shaking for you. <laughs> That's incredible. That is awesome. We'll definitely so be in this again. Guys find, you have to sort That's it. You've got to pack up now. You've got yep. nothing left on your book. On That'll your get soaked list. straight in WD-40 and yeah. get it loose, and that will just sit in there. Look at the thickness of the blade. I know. Well, it'll have been blacksmith made. You could. I could always visualise the guy wearing <laughs> it. Yeah. You know. Wow, that's amazing. So if you reckon that 1500s, easy. 1600s. It'll be just after. Was it Henry VIII died 1548? So some of the Queen Elizabeth II, first rather. Yeah, I'd say it's that. Great, yeah. I'd it's say it's great. Great find. I'd say that 1600s. Go on, go on. <laughs> There's a chat. Go on. I got. Yeah, we have a lot of terrible it's, jokes like it's that. It's time for me to go. <laughs> it's time for me to go. That's nuts. Wow. I can't so believe it. That's. That's amazing. I've got a phone, right. Marie. Huh? I'll let you right. show it first. <laughs> we'll show it on your camera. Oh man, <laughs> that is amazing. So who says it don't get better? Yeah, right, so the sword was good. Of course. Look at that. A dagger in his scabbard. Probably of the same age. Look at that. That is absolutely awesome. It's amazing. Still in its scabbard as well. What's he got an end bit? The same place as he did before. Look at that. Unbelievable. Yeah. The dagger yeah. in its scabbard. Yeah. I don't know what age it is, but that's going to take some research out as well. Brilliant. So I've got a knife and some forks. Scaffold clamp. D lock. Some sort of lever. Well, a box in a bag, nothing in it. A spike, just some chrome rubbish. Carlin, bike lock, shelf bracket, little tiara. But Steve don't want to wear that one. Some 
plastic with a pump in it. Another bit of a bite lock, a spark plug. A chav can thing, got the chav shoes. So that literally has a pin on the top. What they'll do is screw it down, put the mouth around it till it punches it, and try and get the high off it. Disgusting habit, but yeah, chav can holder. And I'll pop another file. <laughs> oh yes. Well, you got a spade. Got a knife. Nice to water now. Oh, wow. Any treasures today? Sure. Yes. Lots of treasures. Wow. Got that. I'm quite sure what it is. It's like, like a brush with no bristles. That's a squeegee, isn't it? It was, yeah. Yeah, that would have been a squeegee. Right, just to give you an idea. Right, here we go. This is what we've pulled out today. As you can see, and that is in a short section, probably only 50 meters that we've done. But that's all being collected first thing in the morning because the scrap man is not about today. But look at that lot, that's ridiculous just from a small stretch. But better out than in, and yes, we're shifting our scrap. So, an absolutely fantastic day out. The sword, amazing, the dagger, really cool. Although we've now found it is World War II. But you can live in hope, but the sword, that's definitely old. Give me some more research on that. Just rusty here now, the others are gone. This is an area, it's not a river, it's a brook. And the stuff that's come out, as you've just seen, is absolutely amazing. But it's been a fantastic day. Miss all the others, but we'll catch you on the next one. See you on Friday.